Hey guys, it's good to see you back. ETA Zero has finally arrived with a wide number of items for sale. We will go over the following items he has for show for Friday the 18th of the 10th, 2024. ETA will be here until the end of Sunday, so be sure to grab his items while you still can. Within his exchange infiltration operation rewards, he has the following of high interest. A storage slot plus 2 for 60 credits. Position code breaker time 6 for 15 credits. A pie form blueprint 15 credits. A Blair code 15 credits. And a Greg's reverse fate synthetic for 15 credits. Out of these, picking up the position code breakers and storage slot is a must for all players. Extra storage space is always going to be helpful one way or another, while precision code breakers are going to help with farming the rare materials that can only be gotten from the vaults. Now I would also recommend you grab the Blair's code blueprint if you haven't gotten him yet. He has received quite a buff that overall makes his kit synergize well with applying high damage in a short amount of time, so he is a sleeper character worth investing in. It also means you won't need to run his mission more times over on normal just for this one piece. Within his exchange supply rewards, he has the following of high interest. A storage slots plus 2 for 60 credits. Equipment slots plus 2 for 60 credits. Ultra precision code breakers times 3 for 15 credits. A crystallization catalyst blueprint 15 credits. A piercing light nanotube 15 credits. A clairvoyance synthetic fiber for 15 credits. Out of these, picking up these storage slots, equipment slots, and ultra pushing code breakers are highly valued. Equipment and storage are pretty self explanatory and should always be in your first purchase when available. Ultra precision codes are also a must with how rare they are with farming them in general, but most importantly, if you have Enzo unlocked, you can use them to try and farm his transcendence mods, which can only be gotten from the vaults in game. Of course, Crystallization Catalyst is also a must-have item that shouldn't be forgotten about either. But in terms of the two weapons blueprints, should you pick them up as well? Well, uh, this will all depend on if you need them or not. A Piercing Light has been picking up traction with Haley players for the high DPS it provides, while Calavoyans has gotten a buff to make them even more stronger than Jaber's turrets. Sorry. If they stand like there for you, then pick them up or hold off until next week's item of show. But yeah, there you go. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you have any thoughts on the content shared, then please leave a comment below. While if you enjoy the content and want more of these videos, then leave a like and a sub while you're here. It was great sharing today's video with you all, and I hope to see you again soon.